Senator Whelan, you have four minutes. Thank you very much, Cahirlock. And as I'm aware that there are urgent and pressing matters uh, waiting a, 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 an imminent announcement in the, in the Dáil relation to the Prime Ministry note deal, I, I, I will be prompt so as to facilitate the Minister. Um, Minister, my, my question to you on the adjournment is straightforward. Uh, as you're aware, the Private Security Authority under a ministerial statutory instrument back in October uh, initiated a new form of licensing regime for uh, people working in the private security sector who are involved in the installation of security-related equipment such as CCTV cameras, uh, electronic gates, uh, electronic and security barriers and so on, which I think is important. It's important that we do indeed have regulation and proper standards. It's important that we don't have any rogue operators and cowboy operators as we have in, in, in other sectors in, in the building industry over the years, much to the detriment of, 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 uh, of uh, consumers and indeed the tradesmen themselves. However, in this instance, I think the licensing regime that has been introduced by the private security authority is draconian. It is the, the, the licensing fee is far too hefty. It is causing severe hardship in the sector. It is punitive. It is putting a lot of pressure on small electrical uh, contractors and small businesses who don't have the resources to meet this level of uh, licensing fee. And uh, it has to be renewed then on a biannual basis. So while it is important to have regulation, it's important that it's also fair rather than punitive. And I understand that the Minister for Justice has agreed with, to, to, to enter into a, a review process with the PSA and that that review process is uh, drawing to a conclusion. So I wonder at what stage is it at and at what stage is the Minister uh, likely to make a, an announcement that will hopefully allay and assuage the fears of people and contractors working within that sector. Thanks, Minister. Thank